Hey guys, what's up? Chad Busley Smith here doing some one minute Q&A. Keith Enderlin asks about, uh, what are the questions that I ask myself before I begin writing a program for an athlete? All right. So I think excellent, excellent question there. Um, you know, first you need to, to examine the, the individual. So their, their training age, uh, their injury history, their mobility, uh, restrictions. Then you need to look at the sport that they play and the position within that sport. Um, so, you know, what do they have to do from a, from a time motion standpoint? You know, what kind of distances are they covering in their sport? What are their recovery periods between those intensive bouts? What are they doing between, between those recovery periods? Is it, you know, a more complete rest like, uh, being in a football huddle? Is it, is it an active rest like in soccer, you know, where they're sprinting and then jogging and running and walking? Um, is it a totally alactic sport like, uh, you know, track and, track and field or weightlifting or powerlifting? Um, and then you need to look at, you know, what part of the year are they in? Um, obviously, the closer they get to their season, you want to use the, the most specific drills. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's pretty much the stuff. You got to look at the athlete. So, you know, they're their individual, their training, their training age, their injury history, their individual weaknesses, strengths, and, and, uh, restrictions. Look at the, look at the sport, look at the position they play, look at the scheme that they play within, if that's applicable, and then look at the time of the year that it is.